Fort Worth figuring out how to make a neighborhood safe from traffic after telling neighbors that these signs you see here had to come down. Joel Thomas live across the street from the TCU campus with the next part of this battle all new at six. Yeah, let me show you the problem. It's all started when TCU started a construction program. That's all uh, parking spaces back there that they lost. Now, on this street here, the cross street, the city says you have to have a permit to park on it. But on the street I'm standing on, no permits required here. So the neighborhood took it in their own hands and put up these. A lot of the cars would sit here for days because they didn't want to lose their spot. State Appellate Judge Larry Myers says he and many of his neighbors have had enough. Construction equipment in the parking lot across the street at TCU drove students into his neighborhood. And so all the kids just parked here, you know, just stacked deep with their big trucks and SUVs uh, for, uh, you know, the whole semester, and it was just a, a nightmare. When the city didn't regulate parking on this street, some of the homeowners took matters into their own hands and put these up. These are not official signs. There is no city ordinance saying you can't park in the public street. We're not trying to be rogue uh, uh, neighbors or anything, and we're, but we're just doing it for safety. You can't put signs in the public right of way. My understanding is the signs are coming down today. Council member Ann Zeta says by ordinance, the unofficial signs have to go. We were not trying to break the law in any means. We were just trying to give the TCU kids notice that uh, we wanted uh, that you, you know, park where the TCU has told you to park. But because of the red flags residents raised, official signs will go up soon. We're working through the proper channels again to have the staff look at that and figure out a solution, whether that be one side of the street parking or limiting the hours that people could park there. Now there is a way to tell if a sign is official. It's back here. An official sign, usually almost every city will put a sticker on here claiming it as their property or saying what ordinance it's for. Unofficial signs have none. Reporting live, Joel Thomas, CBS 11 News.